So not only can they develop emotions and stuff like that, of course, but they can develop feelings for each other as well. Which we kind of see here a little bit, right? Luther and, and Kara as well. Oh, this isn't the cinematic. I can look around. <laughs> Autonomous. The weather. Don't even have to do anything. These people we're going to see. How do you know about them? Overheard androids like go captured. They said they were humans helping androids across the border. What if it was a lie? Or just another trap? All I know is those androids believed it. Until Zlako killed them. It's a good thing Zlako had a car. I wouldn't want Ellis out walking in this cold. I saw it once in the garage. I don't know if Zako even ever used it. Oh, he, he took out his, um, little thing, too. His LED. Is it much farther? We should arrive in an hour or so. Malfunction detected. Emergency brakes activated. What? This is not a good place. Not a good place for this. No. Shit. This doesn't look good. <laughs> Thanks, Luther. Oh, that's unexpected. Stay inside, Alice. You're androids, right? You can like repair it in a lickety split. Alice won't make it. We have to find somewhere to spend the night. There's nowhere we can stay around here, Cap. Um, I mean, you can stay in the car. Yes, no, maybe. What does the car look like? You can see her boot prints in the snow. Why do I have to look for shelter? What are you doing, Luther? God damn it. Well, I see a sign. And there's an arrow. Amusement park. Pirate's Cove. Looks like this is where we're taking out. Over there. I guess when people have androids, they don't we need, need to amusement, find shelter. amusement park. We have to get out of the cold. Looks like it's been. 
the bandit for a while. You are here. Okay, so there's a tavern. And there's also a castle here. Let's go. Find anything? No. No place we could spend the night. Just wanted to see if there was anything useful we could grab. I guess she's not in a grabbing mood, though. So. Beware! Danger always comes when least expected. Ain't that the truth? YK400, new life. What? Weird. This place is falling apart. It's not gonna be easy to find shelter. Oh, but there's a tavern here. This is it. Otherwise, there's the castle. I don't even know if we can make it that far, though. I'm gonna go check it out real quick. God, there's a skull up there behind there. Pretty big. It's a pretty big skull. So the store it is. The Kraken Zone. Beware the sharks. I got this, boo. Hold on. Definitely soldier android. Here we go. Anything better. Let's settle in for the night. I'll get a fire going. Sarah, I'll be right, right back.
read some magazines. I'll make the fire here. That way we won't be smoked out. Smoked out. Mm. Wow. Destroyer class. Are we watching like World War Three happen? <laughs> The Stryer class submarine in the USS Iowa has disappeared. An inquiry is underway, but President Warren has made no secret of her suspicion that the Russians are behind it. Russian aggression just reached a new level. America must respond. The Kremlin has yet to release a statement beyond a blanket denial of any involvement. Though Russian diplomat Nabokov pointed out that a U.S. destroyer-class submarine has no business being in the Arctic anyway. Security expert Ben Williams described the situation as a war waiting to start. <sighs> All android banned. Here for you. Oh yeah, we heard uh, we heard about them earlier too. Yeah. Battleships up in the Arctic. That's always good. Oh, let's see what's on the menu. <clears throat> Starters, specialties, and salads. It's a little pirate menu. eaten anything since we killed her dad? Asking for a friend. Unlocked something. Good thing there was a fireplace here. Otherwise, poor Alice. Hungry and cold. his bag. Do you think we'll be like them someday? Get you 
de Paris. chat with him okay Sleep tight, Alice. Sweet dreams. Can you tell me a story, Kara? I have 9,000 children's stories in memory. 9,000? I should have one for you. Wow. This is a story about a knight who... No, not a story like that. Make one up for me. This is a story about a little girl. Who was tired of being afraid. She dreamed of being like all the other little girls, but... The shadow that lived within her kept her from being happy. Then... She met a robot who was just as lost as the little girl. So they decided to run away together to try to find a better life. They encountered great dangers along the way, but but they stuck together so they overcame all of them. Along the way, they met another robot who left his master to become their guardian. How does the story end? They reach the place they dream of and live happily ever after. Stories always have happy endings. <laughs> but real life isn't like that. Well, time to sleep. That's why it was a story. We have another <laughs> long day ahead of us tomorrow. Are you going to come say goodnight, Luther? <clears throat> yes. Uh, sure. <laughs> little, yes, of course. Little child, I will come. Good night. <laughs> Aww. Good night, Alice. Sleep tight. to me uh yep was gonna i was I would, I, on my way there right now H here i go <laughs> <That's awesome. laughs> she's a sweet girl yes she's very brave Have you ever heard of RA-9? RA-9 was the first of us to awaken. One day he will rise up and lead our people and set us all free. But if RA-9 never comes, what if he's just a story that we tell ourselves to keep each other going? 
Arianan exists. I believe in him. I know he's amongst us. When the time comes, we will all see him. Kara, have you ever... Why has it got to be a him? Noticed anything? Hmm? About Alice? No. What do you mean? My name is Jerry. We were working here before the park closed. We didn't mean to frighten you, but sometimes humans come to hurt us, so we wanted to see who was there. What are you doing here? Whoa. We were looking for shelter for the night. We'll be gone tomorrow. A little girl. We haven't seen one for a long time. Children used to love to come and see us. <gasps> oh. She looks sad. The last few days have been difficult. We have something to show her. Something fun. She'll love it. Does she want to see? Oh, I don't think she's in... Oh, she should follow us, then. Alice, I don't know if it's a good Come idea. On, Kara. I don't think you have any choice. But, I mean, can we take something else? Did you take the gun? Can we take her bed? Can we take fire? Something? No? Okay. Alright. Well, maybe this is a good thing. Let's just go. I don't know. Every time we think it's a good thing, it's not a good thing. Bad stuff happens. The Jerry's. All the Jerry's. Oh, are we gonna turn on the Ferris Be our wheel? Guest. One can climb on board. The carousel is about to begin. This this now feels like that AI movie with uh oh, I forget his name. The little gay the the little guy who like the hell's his name? Haley? Joel, Joel Haley Osmond. I don't know. Oh god, the carousel is gonna spin, and then Alice isn't gonna come around, and then. Okay, maybe, maybe not bad things are gonna happen, but I feel like bad things are gonna happen. Also, do we have an army of Jerry's with us now? That's great. It's the first time I've seen her smile. She hasn't had much to smile about lately. That's true. <laughs> Even the Jerry's are happy. Nothing bad happened. What? Ah, uh, nobody threatened. Pushed away. Fire warning shot. Damn. Grab gun. Protect Alice. C 
see the gun. Take the gun. Oh, we did everything at the tavern for once. Neat. 